we have hit 30k subscribers and I couldn't have done it without you guys and a lot of other people. Now we prioritize quality on this channel. So I made this investment and spent $1,000 on a new intro and I hope you guys like it. Here it is. Can So as you guys can see, this intro is <laughs> But in all seriousness, I need to thank a few people, starting with my older brother Spyro for helping me a lot through this YouTube journey, as well as Ghost in the Cosmos for being a real bro and basically my partner in crime through this whole thing, and Sweepy for always giving me the best advice and being a great mentor. And you know what? All the bros in MVM for just overall being cool dudes and just amazing to talk to. Specifically, the bros at Raw Games because I probably wouldn't even have this channel without them. But that said, the rest of this video, I gotta go back to where it started. That being Shindo, of course, or Shinobi Life 2 at the time when I started. But either way, I'm gonna be using this as the stage for my Q&A portion. And basically, I'm gonna be taking the most popular questions that I get in my Discord and answering them all today. So, I get asked very often, why did you start YouTube? Now, this is actually a pretty funny story. So, basically, my main account got banned from Roblox. Uh, don't ask why but yeah it got banned so I took maybe like half a year of break from Roblox and when I finally came back with my new account I wanted to you know get into all the new games that were on Roblox so of course I searched up some YouTube videos on them and when I saw the absolute abomination and state of YouTubers on the platform I would, could just laugh to myself I was like this is ridiculous what are these videos 20 minutes of uninformative nonsense so I was like I could do better than this and of course I started making my meme videos but I never really took it seriously because I didn't think that it would take off or anything so I just thought that the Roblox community there was no space for just any creativity in your YouTube videos or anything like that you just follow the trend that's what I thought that YouTube was but then I actually saw Sweepy's channel I saw wow this guy's videos are highly edited they're super funny they're just super entertaining I was like, okay, if this guy can make it and he had like 90k subs at the time with 90k subs, it was like, yeah, anyone can do it. And then I met Ghost in the Cosmos, who was only 14 at the time and also had his channel going and he, you know, his video quality, we all know how it is. So I was like, wow, if these two people can make it on this platform and making actually good videos, I guess it's not as bad as I thought it was. So I said, hey, I might as well throw my hat in and look where it got me. Okay, so this is a question I literally get in my comments daily, even in my Discord, people are pinging me asking this, so how old am I? I'm gonna just put the rumors to rest right now. I am 17 years old. I turned 17 this winter. Now, a lot of people say that my voice is very deep, and personally, I don't hear it. Like, I watch my videos, and I don't really hear my voice being that deep, but apparently it is, so... Yeah, people have been accusing me of being 30 years old. I saw one that said Shiver Away is a 54 man that was divorced. Like, uh, what the hell? Okay, no, that, that is not true. I am 17 years old and I am in high school. So here's another good one. Where did the name Shiver Away come from? Now, this story isn't as flashy or interesting as you guys may have thought, but it's a good story nonetheless. So basically, at my elementary school, there was a phrase that people used to say, and we used to say that we would shiver our troubles away. Now, this was because it was really cold in Canada, obviously, and well, my elementary school was borderline just abusing 
children by keeping them outside in the cold for 30 minutes every morning. So me and my friends would uh, get together and say, oh, well, at least we don't have to worry about our homework. You know, we're just shivering that all away. So, you know, it's just something that it was like an inside joke. We all used to say and it was just like a phrase that really stuck with me. And I thought that shiver away was just, you know, a cool combination of words. I thought it just rolled off the tongue. So I just named my channel that. So I don't regret it. I actually really like the name, but uh, now that I think about it, <laughs> yeah, it's a really silly story. Why do you say Wagwan? Yes, this is one I get quite a bit. So if you don't know what Wagwan means, basically this is Jamaican slang for what's up or hello. So you see your friend in the street, you say, hey, Wagwan fam, you know, something like that. But the reason I say is not actually because I'm Jamaican, because I'm not, I am Nigerian and I'm Canadian, but uh, the reason why I say it is that there is so many Jamaicans and the Haitians and where I live, specifically, I live very close to Toronto in Canada, if you know where that is, and uh, yeah, they brought with them a lot of their slang. So it's literally daily I'm hearing, hey, wagwan fam, hey, bumbo clap, you know, it's all that type of slang. And the reason I make sure to say it in all of my videos, so I never forget where I came from. Before I was a YouTuber, before I was anything, before I do anything, I always came from a little town in Canada with my broskies, we say wagwan to each other each day. And that's how it is. So how did I get into anime and start watching it. Well, this is a story I love to tell because as cringe as it may sound, anime really did change my life because I'd be a completely different person and I would be doing lots of different stuff right now if I did not start watching anime. So it goes like this. I think quite literally, how long ago was it? I think nine years ago, I watched a uh, an AMV of Soul Eater which was my first anime, by the way, an AMV of Soul Leader to the song This Is Halloween uh, from The Nightmare Before Christmas. And basically, when, when I watched that, so I saw like all these cool characters like Maka, Blackstar, and it showed the coolest scenes from Soul Leader. I was like, what is this from? Like, is this like a custom animation? And then, you know, I went to the comments and then someone had actually just pirated the entirety of Soul Leader there and they left links to it. So I watched the first episode of that and I was, I was just absolutely hooked. I finished the entire thing and I just loved it. And that AMV that I'm talking about is still on YouTube right now. You guys should go check it out because it's actually really cool. And if you haven't watched Soul Eater already, you should go watch that AMV and you probably will watch it after that. So after Soul Eater, the next thing I watched was Naruto because uh, I, I, you know, I was looking for um, another anime to watch and I heard people talk about Naruto before. I watched that. I loved it even more and it's still my favorite anime to this day and you know the rest is history I just became a complete weeb watching everything as it comes out and that was all nine amazing years ago now guys to really show my appreciation to all I'm going to be doing multiple giveaways for a total of 100k robux over the span of six months so there's going to be a lot and a lot of winners so i've already started it in my discord by doing a quick 2k uh give robux giveaway for all of my uh twitter followers but i'm going to continue this by doing a small giveaway every single video so basically what i'm going to be doing if you leave a funny comment and that comment makes me laugh like genuinely makes me laugh that I'll actually pick you and if you're in my group I'm gonna give you a small payout of Robux and I plan to do that on every single video and it started with my last one so that person has already been paid now apart from that if you join my discord I have a full giveaways channel which I'll also be doing nitro giveaways Robux giveaways and just a lot of stuff to just you know give back to the community that made me something 
and especially my OG fans that would be in my Discord. So overall, you know, if you guys want to get in on these giveaways, just comment, like the video, subscribe if you haven't already, and just keep sticking with me because I really appreciate it. So finally, from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys for actually, you know, making my channel, making me, making me shiver away basically. Really thank you for, you know, watching my videos, tuning in. Like, I don't know, it's just so crazy to me to think that 30,000 people saw my content, liked it, and actually hit subscribe. Like, that is just super insane. And I have to say a thank you again to everyone that even got me here, because alone I would be nothing. So thank you all. Now that said, I hope you guys will keep watching my videos. I'll see you all in the next one.